Um, first question I got to ask you, have you ever encountered a game where there was an earthquake and they had to postpone it during the game during an earthquake? Were you... Did you know what was going on? Did you like feel it when it happened and stuff like that? Or? I didn't feel anything. I just heard them talking about it, saying okay. that it was early. Okay. So now as far as the game, um, obviously you came in off the bench, but you, uh, Coach was already talking about the spark that you gave. He said that he feels um, you have a lot of trust in you. You know, you played a lot of years in, in uh, WNBA, and he knows what he's going to get um, um, with you. So what, what, what's your mentality when you've been a starter, you know, for many years previously, and now you're kind of coming off the bench? What's your mentality when Coach does put you in the game there? Control what I can control, um, be aggressive, play hard, play smart. That's really about it. Okay. And so um, if I'm not mistaken, you guys head out on the road now, I think, for the next uh, six or seven games. So what, what's the outlook, um, you know, at this point going forward on that road trip there? Uh, just taking it one game at a time. Um, that's all we can do. That's all we talk about doing even when we're at home, just taking it one game at a time. Each game is like a playoff game. Everyone's fighting for position. So... Okay, got you. And um, how did you feel about the energy, you know, with the with the fans and the crowd there? I think uh, John Wall was there. Um, another reality star from a Love & Hip Hop show. I can't recall her name or anything, but... Why? What did you feel about the energy from the crowd out there today? In the first oh, we always have a great crowd. We always have great energy. Uh, no matter if it's NBA players here or not, our fans here in Las Vegas is amazing. And each game, we always talk about that, like how they bring the energy and how yeah. they've been supporting us since day one.